Hello everyone, in this tutorial today, we shall be learning how to design website banner in Microsoft Word. To get started, we open up your Word document blank template. Come to layout, go to margins, click on it select that orientation we use portrait size you come down to more page sizes click on it as you open up you have three options here the margin the paper and layout on the paper you click on this six and then here which is height within three then click ok you come to zoom and increase it so that you have enough visibility of the document you have in your computer to be able to design the banner you come to design tab go to page color click on it I'll be using this color for this tutorial as my page color. Then we'll come to insert tab. As it opens up, click on shapes, select rectangle. We draw a rectangle on the document. From these dots, you can resize it. To your desire you come to shape format tab click on it go to shape view click on this one and then shape outline you select no outline you come to insert tab again go to shapes click on this one we draw it across the document come to shape format tab shape view Click on this one, shape outline, no outline. Go to insert tab, click on shapes, select lines, you draw a straight line. Come to shape format, click on this drop down, then you can see different forms of lines. You select any one that suits. What you are doing, I'll be using the dotted line. I click on it, then I copy and use Ctrl V to paste. I move the dotted line to the other end of the design. Go to insert tab, click on chips, click on lines again, then I draw another line at the top of the design. Go to shape format. And then I choose dotted line again. I use Ctrl C to copy and Ctrl V to paste. Then I move it down, go to insert, click on shapes. I choose this shape. I draw it on the design, shape format style. Click on edit shape and then edit point. Click on shape format, shape fill. I choose this color, shape outline, no outline. From here, I rotate the shape. Click on the shape, right click, copy. I use Ctrl V to paste. I move it up to the left hand side. I reduce the size. Click on it. Right click or use Ctrl C to copy. Then I use Ctrl V to paste. I move this one to the right hand side. Then I resize it. Come to insert. Tab, 
to the conchips select oval address cycle here shift format tab I select this no outline go to insert tab click on pictures click on the folder where I save the picture that I want to use I select the first picture click on insert picture format click on wrap text select in front of the text I increase the size then I position it where I want it to be I go to insert tab again click on pictures I select the next picture that I want to use picture format wrap text in front of the text I move it increase the size I put it here I want it go to insert tab pictures I select the next picture picture format wrap text in front of the text I move the picture I resize the picture then I come to insert tab again click on picture select the logo click insert picture format wrap text in front of the text then I move it up if you notice it's too bright change the color to white insert tab pictures picture format tab wrap text in front of the text then move the logo to this position then the next thing is to go to insert text group click on word add I choose this one click on home tab and select clear all format then I type in leave for fashion shift format wrap text in front of the text move it up highlight the text go to home tab click on center remove space highlight fashion go to home tab font I choose Algerian red I move it up go to insert tab word art click on this one home tab clear all formatting shape format wrap text in front of the text then I move it to the right hand side I type in mid season cells highlight it from home tab I reduce the font I move it up a bit then I type in 30% off go to home tab center it remove space go to home tab use red and then I put it I can change the font come to insert tab word add go to home clear up formatting shape format wrap text in front of the text then I move it down I put in the website so that all contacts can be done through there I reduce the size and move it down To see the preview, I click on File, go to Print. So this is the preview, and to save it, I go to Save As. I select where I want to save my document, which is desktop in this tutorial. I give my document a name. I give it Sophia Stick. 
then I select PDF, then I save. I save it on PDF. So this is the PDF of the website banner we just designed. So we have come to the end of this tutorial today. Hope you get some value from it. If you did, please give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon so YouTube will notify you once I drop a new video. And do share this video with family and friends. Have a beautiful day.